drivers, bar goers, seem to be amping up their awareness as well. News to Kate's Catherine Underwood. She joins us live in the old point. And Catherine, I can bet it's pretty busy here right now. There, Greg, the party is well underway here in the Old Port. Take a look. People are already lining up and uh, filing into the bars around here. And really, it was just a nightmare trying to find parking, as you can imagine, with all of these people. So that must mean that many of these people heading into the bar to enjoy some cocktails also drove here. Now, thankfully, we're seeing cabs driving by one after the other, providing safe rides home. And it turns out that every person we talked to planned ahead and before getting too drunk knew just how they'd be getting home. I'm either going to take a cab or sleep over at my friend's house. We are from Connecticut, so we, we're going to take one of those taxis out there to our hotel room. The plan was to get out of our small town and go somewhere where we didn't have to drive. The New Year's Eve revelers are getting some help from bar managers who are amping up awareness about how much they serve and also car services that are out in force tonight, helping everyone get home safe and sound. We have cabs right out front here. Uh, you know, a lot of these guys on the first name basis, so everybody needs a ride. We point them in the right direction. People take it seriously. There's a lot of people who have already learned a lesson, and so they know that they don't want to go down that road again. So, yeah, I mean, people are doing the right thing, and they're, they're able to go out and party and still be responsible, and, yeah, I applaud that. Absolutely. How many teams you said you have three teams? Dan First and his team at Home Runners not only drive you home, but your car, too. They are already booked from midnight until 4 a.m. tomorrow. But it's certainly something something to think about whenever you're drinking, uh, because cabs and Home Runners are available every single night of the week. So we are hoping that everyone makes good decisions out here tonight. It is looking like a lot of fun. People are having a couple drinks. So we're hoping that people make the right decision. They don't get behind the wheel. They don't drive if they've been drinking because we can assure you that there are patrols that are amped up tonight and there are sobriety checkpoints everywhere. So if you get the behind the wheel and you have been drinking, you are going to get caught. We are live here.